today we have a special tag video for you all. We are going to do the... 90s. The 90s tag. So, we were both kids during the 90s. I was born in 1990. And I was born in 93. So we both have, obviously, a lot of childhood memories from the 90s. So we thought it would be a really fun tag to do together. Mm -hmm. So we have nine different questions and I also have brought something extra into this video. Du -du 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 -du. The magical 90s box. In this box I have put some 90s like toys that are found in the attic and also I went out and bought some 90s like candies and things like that. So um, we are going to dive into this box along with like answering the questions. This is going to be really nostalgic for us. It's going to be a nostalgia trip. And hopefully for some of you guys too. You yeah. don't know everything that's in this box. No. So it's going to be really fun to see your reactions too. I think I know like two or three things from yeah. in there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so uh, you ready? Uh, yeah, sure. Let's yeah. dive right in there. Yeah, let's do this. So the first question is, your favorite Disney film? On the top of my head, I can just remember Hercules being yeah. like one of my favorites. It was, was that so, in 90? I, I don't 90s? know. It was yeah, 97. 90s. Okay. Yeah, it was in 97. So yeah. yeah, I was four. You were four. I was seven. Yeah, I was oh four. God. I was four years old. Oh my god, I was uh, only seven when Hercules came out. Yeah, I was oh only god. four. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, but I, I just remember that really fondly. It was, it was so such great music and yeah, the, the art music. style is amazing. And I saw this movie not long ago with a friend of mine and just such a great classic. I yeah, think. yeah, I really like that one too. But if you've followed me for a while, this is pretty obvious. I have to say Winnie the Pooh. And he's called Nalle Pooh in Swedish. So this is the original Winnie the Pooh movie. And I just love this one so much. He's my all-time favorite Disney character. And I also absolutely loved like the new adventures of Winnie the Pooh, like the TV series. Yeah. Uh, I loved those, but this movie is such a good, feel-good movie. And I really like the book. It is a book. And that they turn reading. the pages and how when it's raining all of the like letters kind of uh, float, away. float away and I just feel like that's so cool so I love this movie but I also really love Lady and Tramp, 101 Dalmatians and Aristocats just because it's animals I think yeah animals um, talking is always fun favorite music artist during the 90s I think it was either five yeah. or Backstreet Boys. Um, yeah, kind of, but it was like five because I thought they were cooler somehow because they had okay. like, they did some kind of rock and roll <laughs> songs instead. And I was like, yeah, yeah they're so cool. And For me, it was obviously Britney Spears and Spice Girls. Spice Girls. Like, seriously, Spice Girls were huge you, here. You were um, so in fun. Yeah, I, I had like <clears throat> Spice Girls themed like birthday parties yeah. with my friends so everyone would dress up as their favorite Spice Girls and uh, you know the Spice Girl cards that you could yeah. get and collect and everyone in school was obsessed with them and I was too uh, but I also really liked Backstreet Boys and Westlife I remember like listening to, to like Hammerfall like, yeah like you listened so much power metal what? It was so Hearts funny. of Fire yeah Hearts of Fire Hearts of Fire burning burning I guess that sums it up pretty good. Yeah. Here comes a really funny one. Favorite candy sweeties. And in this box I actually bought some things that I could get a hold of. Like obviously a lot of the things in, in the 90s I can't get a hold of yeah. anymore. But some things I managed to get a hold of. So let's open this box and see uh, what you can find in the bottom. Is it like these? Yeah? Oh yeah, it's, 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 it's the necklaces and armbands yeah. that are candy. They're not really tasty, but you still They're always want them. But it's because you could wear them, that was yeah. the cool part. You so, were like, yeah, I can have them wear the arms. Yeah, yeah. And if I get hungry and I'm like lost in the woods, I can just eat my necklace. Yeah. I'll be fine. This is like memories. 
Oh, it's like a watch. Yeah. Mine says 9.40. You could bring him to school and the teachers would be like, oh, I can't bring candy into the, the lecture. And you're like, I don't have candy because this is a bracelet. Just spoil Oh my god, the they taste the same. When you were a kid, these were like the thing. These were the bomb. Haba baba. Oh. Gum. Do you remember these? Of course. The ones uh, with the Coca Cola taste were the bomb. It, it, I, I would live on those for I would. Oh my work. god, the taste. This brings me back. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I feel like I'm 10 years old again. <laughs> this is going to take a while. Maybe two or too much. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember them being this big. <laughs> Me neither. No! You're so good! Your beard! <laughs> no! It's stuck in my beard! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, When you breathe for your nose, it's kind of like. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't choke on it. Now dive into the box and see if you can find anything more uh, candy like. Oh, I see one directly. Kinder eggs. America, they're illegal. They are? Yeah. What? I think it because was. Because of the toys? Like yeah, it was like parts? choking hazard or something. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, so it's basically like um, a surprise toy inside these chocolate eggs. Um, so it was like a really fun thing to to get because you never knew what toy you were going to end up with and these mm. were so good I always remember oh. Remember when I ate these I took out the toy and I ate and I Deliberately like made it so small pieces fell into the bottom. So I mm -hmm. ate the small pieces. I yeah. love this mm. I dropped it. <laughs> what did you get? So you open them up Oh my god, there's a lot of things in here. I got a Sprinty. It's like an animal uh, motorcycle combined. And I got a crocodile one. I got a this mix one. art. You, it, it, you. So it's different like sea creatures and you got a red fish. fish. It's like a magnifying glass and you're apparently supposed to use them on different pictures and stuff. <laughs> Oh yeah, you got a little yeah, motorcycle. This is more like the real Kinder Egg <laughs> surprise stuff. You actually build together a little like crocodile trike or whatever it is. He can, you know, change his like driving stance and stuff. Oh, that's so cool! Uh, but, but seriously, in a piece of candy, that's actually a cool yeah. toy. He has serious stats in the back. <laughs> that's so cool. That is actually pretty. You should have gotten this one. You can, you can, you can. I can take the magnifying glass. I'm mm -hmm. starting mm -hmm. to get old, so I probably need it soon. No, he's, he's yours. I've been expecting you, Mr. Bob. <laughs> yeah. Don't come close, I have my pet <laughs> with me. You have your pet with you. And I can also ride away on him very <laughs> quickly. <laughs> I'd like to see you try and see him. <laughs> the most kind of treat thing are... Oh, God. These! Big baby pop! This is like a really weird thing. To be honest, like, I don't see how this is like even tasty. So you have this like baby bottle and this is like a solid hard candy. And you're supposed to lick it and then you're dipping it into this powder, this flavored powder. And you're supposed to shake it around and then it's covered in this powder. So that's basically what you do like a hundred times over. Oh my god, no, it really tastes like cola candy. Big baby bop, big baby bop, 
and you shake it until it's covered and then you lick it off. <laughs> You're really happy about this one. Yeah, remember us leaving these around the house and they would get you really and like nasty. hair would get yeah. stuck on them a week after like I can eat that. It's probably still good. It's still good. I, I it's promise still good. it's still good. It, it tastes only fell good. on the floor. It's like it's a bit weird in the beginning, but it tastes good, I promise. It tastes good. It's like come on. I can't have any more of this. This is just sugar. Do you think you're maybe done? Drop it. <laughs> is your favorite game. It could be board game or school game, etc. Hi. Yeah, quest. we played a lot of Video PC game. games. Yeah, PC games. Um, and I remember like Disney PC games like yeah. Hercules and oh, The Lion yeah. King, the, Jungle Book, yeah, Jungle like Book. the Sega version. Yeah, the Sega version. Um, 101 Dalmatians, uh, Hype. Is it Playmobil. called Playmobil? Yeah, Playmobil. Playmobil. We played a lot with Playmobil when we were kids. Yeah. We yeah. built like entire cities and everything. And they had a PC game uh, called Hype. Time um, quest. Yeah, and that was like a Playmobil dude. Yeah, it like was a knight. Playmobil adventure. Yeah. With a real deep story about time travel and everything. Yeah, he was going to save like the world. In like terms of board games, I remember Buckaroo. Do you remember Buckaroo? It was oh, like a, yeah. a, a donkey that you were supposed to like pack full with items, and the one person that kind of overpacked him yeah. uh, made him. Uh, do like a he bucked. back. F no, he bucked. He kicked with uh, his back legs. Is it called bucked? Yeah, it's. Oh, okay. Buck. Oh, I didn't I know think. that. I also remember Cluedo. Cluedo. Oh, do you yeah. Remember? Cluedo. I, uh, yeah, I remember that. Because uh, um, I always wanted to be General Mustard. Yeah. I, I, th yeah. I thought it was so cool. Yeah. We were a lot into PC games. Yeah. So most of our like childhood 90s Lego game. Racers. Where, yeah, Lego <laughs> Racers and uh, Lego Rock, Rock Raiders. Raiders. Yeah, yeah. The Rock Raiders. Oh my god, that was so good. And in, like um, Age of Empires and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah, um, those were like the early days. Caesar 3. Oh, Caesar 3, um, yeah. Favorite McDonald's Happy Meal toy? Oh my god. We loved Happy Meals when we were kids. Yeah. I can really remember these ones. Different figures from the Lion King, like a yeah, teddy version. Plushies. Yeah, plushies. And when you squeeze them, they made a noise. The noises were so weird. They were no, so they, off. They didn't yeah. really sound like a lion, you know. It just sounded or like a any character. angry pig or something. It just sounded huh. so hilarious. Like, I think <laughs> I got, like, Nala. Yeah. And she was like, Bleh. Yeah. <laughs> I remember these. Do you remember them? It's like when you hit them into something, they would start laughing or yeah! stuff like that. Oh my god! They were like monsters! Yeah. Oh you would toss god. them around like into yes. a wall and they would just laugh and make a noise like some oh, some glock so or broken like and just show laugh. Them that. Oh, and then I remember that was so fun. I used to remember like all the the action man came with a hang glider once. One of them actually had a parachute as well. I got so many of those, I don't know why. Friends gave them to me and stuff at school. So I had like five at home and I would throw it once and it looked so cool because I remember looking at Band of Brothers. They were uh, parachuters, all of them, like yeah. military. And I thought it was so cool throwing them from the balcony out of here yeah. and I just seeing them fall down. I was like, oh, it's so oh cool, God. it's for real. We also have some other toys, not McDonald's Happy Meal toys, but other toys yes. that we really like played with and remember from the 90s that I have in this box. So, um, the first thing I guess are these. Maybe you didn't play with them as much, but, no, but I, I sure did. These. Of course I they... think they were called Sky Fairies or something. Yeah, or something. Um, sky Dancers or something. Sky Dancers, maybe. Do you want to do it? Yeah, but you have to. You have to. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! It right up the ceiling. It almost hit the camera. Yeah, I know. Um, I'm so sorry. I had like this one with dolphins on that I really loved. I also had this one, which was so cool. Pull it. No, do it. Uh, why am I? Oh god! <laughs> oh my god! They're just like 
I, okay. I understand why your mom was so mad. So, I used to play with these so much outside, and I cannot tell you how many times my dad had to climb the roof to get them. Yeah, because yeah. they always flew up and landed on the roof. These still hold. Yeah. After being but used I think, for like seven years. I think years. they kind of discontinued them because I think the people kind of got hurt. Um, Surviving our childhood is. Yeah, we lived a pretty hardcore life. Do you remember these? Yeah, leave your hand on. Uh, the like slimy hand. Uh. <laughs> they were really fun to play with, uh, but they always got really dirty and filled with like hairs yeah. and dust and nasty things after like you, 10 you minutes. Got, you got one um, and it was amazing and you brought it to school and never brought it back home. No. Uh, no. <laughs> 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 High five. <laughs> I think it says on the box. Uh, with this, you can you can grab anything from two meters. Like you're supposed to use this as like a grabbing tool. Like I want this lip gloss. <laughs> you're, supposed to, you're supposed to grab it with this one, but I mean, it can obviously not hold onto anything. Oh no! Oh, I did. kind of got the wet vibes. <laughs> <laughs> it's so clumsy. It's like, yeah. Oh, you almost got it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 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 no. <laughs> Wait for it. We might need to do some retakes to get this right. <laughs> Just on the tip of my nose. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> Look at all these hairs. Like already, this is just so nasty. Yeah, and we haven't played with it long. Oh my god. <laughs> I remember these so bad. They were so fun. You. gonna work for that and um, I, I used call shenanigans on that because it never works okay yeah enough I'm enough right, I don't trust right, you with this yeah, anymore yeah. the next toy that I remember um, was called Loppur oh do you yeah, remember yeah, Loppur yeah. I guess these are like the modern version do you want a yellow or a green one okay. I'll take the yellow one yeah the ones that we used were only made out of rubber and it, it didn't have this middle thing so it I just don't really know yeah I don't air. really know like what this is supposed to do but you turn them inside out just like with this one then you're supposed to now with these ones turn these um why would you I don't know how does that even help and then drop flat down it's not happening anything <laughs> Be careful, it's probably gonna fly. Yeah, your right face in my anytime. face. I'm scared to move it. Mine's just laying there. <gasps> oh. Ouch. I have no idea what you're supposed to do with this. <laughs> like, uh. what? It's easy. Push the seas bees inside out. Done. Two. Spin. Drop it flat Wait. down. Oh, it means okay. Like this. Oh. oh my god, oh, all okay! Right. You're supposed to spin it while you drop it. But you have Can to you drop do it, it on here, do you think? Uh, I don't know, I have to be... <laughs> they actually fly pretty high. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right on my leg! <laughs> you're pretty high. Oh. <laughs> pretty high. Oh. 
<laughs> right on my leg. It didn't jump though. Oh, it was pretty ass like, I like just it. hit his uh, thigh. I'm scared. They don't pay you, they don't hurt you. <gasps> oh. Ah, oh, shit. Ah. <laughs> okay, yeah. So. You don't even have to do it hard. Just give him a, It's the spin that makes him jump. Um, these were something that we played with a lot and then later on you and your friends tossed them down the stairs when I wasn't home and I get really angry with you. We like put them in like action man cars and stuff and, and, and we drove that car down the stairs and they would just fly all about and you know just flub tongue, around yeah, with their... flub around because they're just ragdolls. <laughs> We, we built a little barricade and then we drove a phone book down on them, <laughs> crashing into the barricade and they flew everywhere. It was so funny, I just remembered. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> August, if you're seeing this, you know what, the, what I'm talking about. It was so funny. Well, clearly I was not the only one playing with these. No. Next question. Favorite book? Red Bull. Yeah. <laughs> You used to read them a lot. Brian uh, Jacques' uh, Red Wolf series were really good. It's a fable of like uh, yeah. forest animals, like uh, regular mice and badgers, and you know, all, all of the simple like grass eaters. They lived like in a monastery. Foxes? No. No foxes were usually like the evil guys. Oh, uh, okay. As long like the, predators. Yeah, predators yeah. were the evil guys and rats. I don't know. It was really serious and sometimes pretty grim and dark. Actually, there were actually a lot of animals who died in those yeah, series. That's why I didn't want to read yeah. them because it was too like sad for me. They were like fighting for real, and it was it was pretty cool. Uh, I just really liked it because it had such good scenery and the uh, author really could describe food so great. <laughs> no, food. the way he described it was so crazy because he just used what is in a forest and what those kind of animals eat, but he made it into human food like okay. big pies and big cakes and you know oh, wine okay. and okay. daisy lemonade that they really oh. loved and like all, all that kind of stuff. It was really, <laughs> really, really cool. That sounds really cute. I don't know if I had like a favorite book when I was little. I used to um, read a lot of um, Adam and Eve. Uh, yeah. That was a Swedish book um, about two teenagers called Adam and Eve and their relationship and their classmates and like drama and stories the around them. Um, growing up. Yeah and love and everything like that, so I used to read them a lot. Favorite clothing store? I didn't really have a favorite clothing store when I was a kid. My mom shopped all of my clothes, but I guess she shopped a lot at H&M and... Yeah. Uh, I just remember wearing know. these super cool shirts called No Fear. They were just two eyes that looked really like evil and angry and it oh, said No wait, Fear. Yeah, I remember them. And it said No Fear on them and those were really cool. I thought they were like, yeah. So yeah, I don't guess we have like a favorite clothing store, but like the fashion styles, it was like chokers and pigtails in your hair yeah. and your jeans was really flared out. Yeah. Um, you had like glittery belts and uh, um, like fake tattoos. Oh and yeah, the rub Like <laughs> glitter tattoos, rub-ons. You basically wanted to look like Spice Girls. Or Backstreet Boys, like cool guys. Yeah. Favorite Nick Jr. show? I guess Nick Jr. was like a TV channel. We don't have that channel here in Sweden or we yeah. didn't. Um, we had Disney Channel and Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, yeah, uh, Fox Kids, Jetix and things like that. Yeah. The shows on there, we watched so many shows. My favorite shows um, during the 90s were SWAT Cats and Centurions. Centurions who were three guys who were specialized in different things. One was an aviator, one was a like land commander and one was a sea operator or something. And they had this space station that would beam down different kits to their armor because they had like holes in their armor so they could put on different kinds of things for different kind of missions. I that. It was so cool and they had a dog who had also some armor so you could beam down kits to it so you could have like different laser guns and everything. It was so cool. I thought it was so awesome. I really loved Fred Flintstone, Scooby-Doo, 
uh, because I liked like the mystery and yeah. the detective like aspects. I love things like that. But it was still not like scary. Tom and Jerry, My Little Pony, Lucky Luke. Luke. Oh, Lucky, Lucky Luke. Luke! You watched so much Bang, Lucky Luke. Lucky Luke, yeah, I'm I'm your Lucky Luke. Luke. Little Spain. Like the TV series, Aladdin, yeah, and then Looney episodes, Tunes and, stuff like and that. Looney Tunes, yeah, and like the Little Mermaid episodes. Yeah, oh um, my god, the Little Mermaid episodes. Yeah, they were good. <laughs> Johnny Quest. Johnny Quest. Johnny Quest, that was so yeah. cool. Oh my god, it was my favorite. It was so like action and stuff, and I loved it. And like sorrow. Oh yes, Batman. sorrow and Batman. Backpack and Quackpack, the, uh, yeah. Rescue Rangers. Yeah. But and and uh, Ducktales. Yeah, Ducktales. Yeah. Ducktales um, was really good. I think they were sharks. Oh yeah, and yeah. They had no, like a, a girlfriend. Oh Do you yeah, Sailor, Sailor Moon. Moon. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Thomas the Tank Engine. The yeah, tank engine. yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. my God, oh. I watched so you were much. So Thomas. Yeah. With that. I was obsessed oh. with Thomas the Tank Engine. It was so that awesome. That was really cute. Oh my God, I just feel like so nostalgic right now. I like this. The, the type of TV series that they made in the 90s yeah. were just so well made. Yeah. Like they were, they would draw these beautiful pictures and backgrounds and colorful things and they would do like Thomas the Tank Engine yeah. with like models of trains yeah. and everything and they were so well made and I just feel like so happy that my childhood yeah, was like, was like the... growing up to those kind of quality series. The last question is, what would you watch when you got home from school? And I feel like it's basically the same question. Yeah, because um, we just watched that when we came home from school. That yeah. So that was this 90s tag video done and dusted. A trip down memory lane. Yeah. And it was so much fun. Uh, I hope you guys had fun watching this video. And if you were a 90s kid and you have some childhood memories, from that time then please tell us about them in the comments down below because we would love to hear what you remember from the 90s also we have probably so much more things that we remember from the 90s but just but forgot about yeah. in time or exactly or whatever we are going to go now uh thank you so much for being in my video no thank worries it's always fun yeah we always have so much fun but we do talk quite a lot when we film together <laughs> I'm going to leave all the other videos that we have done together in the description box if you want to see more videos. And yeah! Goodbye! And thank you for watching! Thank you so much for watching! Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it! And I'll see you in my next video! Bye! Bye. Sure. I don't have candy because this is a bracelet! <laughs> <laughs>